Red Birds, it's Riley. Today we're making garlic Brussels sprouts. For this recipe, you need 10 Brussels sprout heads cut in half, two cloves of garlic, a tablespoon of butter, a tablespoon of olive oil, salt and pepper, and freshly grated Parmesan cheese. To pre prepare the Brussels sprouts, we're gonna wash them, and you'll notice that there's a little stem. We wanna cut that off, but we want the head to hold together, so don't cut too far into the Brussels sprout. Just as close to the stem as possible to get that off, and your head should still hold itself together. Then we're just gonna take it and cut the head in half, and that's all the preparation that we need. For the garlic clove, we're going to smush it. Now we do this to let all the aroma in the garlic seep out and it'll make our butter mixture really aromatic. If you just put it in there like that, it's not gonna do much. So we're gonna take our knife with the blade side pointed away from us and just smash down on it. Nice and smooth, you might have to do it more than once, but you'll notice it's nicely smashed and it's already, uh, you can already feel the juices. So once we got that, we're gonna take our butter and our olive oil, turn our oven on to medium high heat And starting lower is always better, because if you burn your butter, you're gonna have to start over. So start nice and slow. But add the butter and the olive oil. And then just let that melt. All right, our garlic has become nicely browned. So now we wanna take it out. Now this is why we didn't chop it into small pieces earlier, because we wanna remove it. Biting into a big chunk of garlic does not taste good. So get all the big chunks out. There's little small pieces, you can leave them in, but try to get as much of it as you can. Then our butter sauce is nicely fragrant. Now we're gonna add the breast sprouts. Gonna put them in with the cut side down. And be careful when you put them in. It'll pop just a little bit, and that's to be expected. them all evenly spaced, then we're going to put the lid on top. <clears throat> so we're gonna leave the lid on and that's all we're gonna do. We're not gonna flip them or turn them or mess with them in any way. We'll leave them in there for about 10 to 15 minutes until they become nice and tender. All right, now that it's been about 15 minutes, we're gonna check to see if they're done. We're just gonna pierce the top of one and if our knife goes through it nice and gently, it's good to go. Yep, they are nice and tender. So you can see that they're nice and glistening at the top and you can see around the edges that they've started to brown and that's exactly what we wanna see. We're just gonna plate them, so just Spoon them into your plate, nice and gently. You don't want them to fall apart. All your butter and olive oil should have been absorbed just about. Okay, they look beautiful. You can see that they're nicely browned. So all we have left to do is to add a little bit of salt and pepper to it. And some Parmesan cheese. Just sprinkle it over the top. 
And there you have it, simple and delicious garlic Brussels sprouts.